I think this year will be the year where I simply don't overthink things. Like making this cup of coffee at our hotel room. It might not be the perfect and best coffee, but it's better to enjoy what's available rather than miss out on it. And this got me thinking. Right now, we are on our way back to Amsterdam from Barcelona, and I'm always feeling like I need things to be perfect and look the best rather than simply document what's immediately available to me. So, I figured that I might as well show you how it would be to travel with us and document today's journey without overthinking. Because after all, it's better to be done with a project than never post it because it's not perfect. Just hit record. That's something that I've been trying to do myself a lot more when it comes down to creating content and not trying to doubt what I'm going to be making that day. See, I feel like us as creators, we tend to fear that moment when we're about to hit record because we want to have everything as perfect as possible when it comes down to that moment of recording. And that's probably my biggest issue that sometimes I want to do certain types of videos that I just choose not to and I don't, you know, get into the zone of just recording and figuring it out as I go. And today I wanted to challenge myself because we were going on our way from Barcelona to Amsterdam and I wanted to document a little bit of the things of the day of the travel to make some sort of video with a theme. And to me, it just kind of sparked that, you know, brain activity to say, just hit record. And that for me, it was something important to just go ahead, get the camera rolling and find the camera and set up that would make me want to record. I started just kind of bringing the ZV-E1 with a 20 to 70 F4 by Sony, because for me, it was just something that would make me actually record while I'm out and about because of the compact setup that I would have to be able to not miss a single shot that I would want to create without overthinking it. And that's something that I feel that most of us get in that awkward stage where we don't want to record certain scenarios or things because we kind of fear what people might think of us or we might fear that it's just not going to be the most cinematic or the best outcome if I just, you know, shoot without planning anything. And for me personally, I've been wanting to do more on the go type of creating so that I can find better outcomes faster and problem solve my situation to create a better framing, the lighting and everything that I can to just have something that will make me think harder and faster so that if I ever have that problem arise with a client work, I can do it on the spot and be good to go. Which it brings me to the next point that I wanna make when it comes down to this video is allowing yourself to create by having the gear that makes you create. A lot of us tend to overthink what setup to bring, what setup to use, and limiting yourself, uh, like I've talked before in my videos, is something that has just helped me out more and more to just create without thinking too much and simply just reacting. And it's honestly helped me out to create some of my most favorite videos where I don't overthink it and I just go and show up to do. And it works out for me because it makes me happy. Some of you guys enjoy it, which I appreciate it. But overall, I do what I'm supposed to be doing and just going out to create. So now that's what I'm gonna be doing here right now in Amsterdam. I'm just gonna be documenting a little bit more of my day and taking some photos if I see them, but mainly just creating videos and hitting record. So you're gonna to get to see what I'm gonna to get to see today because it's our first day here in Amsterdam and I wanna just record what I can, show you some nice B-roll of the situation, maybe give you some talking points and have a lovely day outside. Because I've heard that it's a very nice, beautiful day by everybody today. It's been our taxi driver, the check-in uh, hostess that kind of helped us out with getting our room and everything, has told us that it's just been such a beautiful day that everybody wants to be outside. So we're gonna take it at face value and simply just go out to create some content, see the city to plan for the next few days for the type of videos I want to make while here and kind of find the spots that I want to hit up. And that way, just get to show you guys a little bit of Amsterdam. So before going out to explore the city any further, we first have to refuel ourselves. So that means food. Hot. Hot but good. It's time to roam the streets of Amsterdam. You can see so many people walking, cycling, or in boats. You get the occasional car, but the streets of Amsterdam are honestly made for people to walk anywhere, or of course, bike. 
For me, my initial day was to simply explore and document. Hit record at anything that captured my eye that I thought was interesting enough to me whether I used the footage or not. I just simply wanted to hit record. The streets of Amsterdam just have so much going on that I feel like I can point my camera at any direction and capture something happening. Like people walking the city trams or a flock of birds flying around the city center. There's just so much to capture. To be honest, sometimes hitting record doesn't have to make sense to others. It just has to make sense to you. Sometimes it's simply just the framing you liked or the way the light hit that caught your eye. But whatever it might be, just hit record and document whatever your heart desires. And that's what I decided to do today. I wanted to have these moments to share with myself whenever I wanted to look back into these memories and as well to share them with you and showcase how I saw things and what intrigued me throughout my day. Well, we're kind of finishing up our walking and exploring today because it's been nice out here, but a little tired. We're about to be back at the hotel so I can give you some you know, final thoughts on this video today because it's just been a good day to be out to create on the first day in Amsterdam before we do some more creating. But, you know, like I said, sometimes you just gotta record. Well, we're back from just kind of having a little bit of exploration, taking a lot of B-rolls and some photos, just because I wanted to kind of explore where I want to head out in the next few days to take some photos and videos that I want to create for some videos. But that's pretty much when it comes down to, you know, doing for yourself to just kind of sometimes not really have a storyline, but just go ahead and start creating and see what kind of flows and what creates like within itself from, you know, pressing, you know, hit record kind of style from your camera. A lot of the times we try to overthink it and kind of not get, you know, we get a little bit overwhelmed by it. And at least that's what happens to me and, I, and some of my friends as well when I've talked to them about it, whenever we kind of discuss some ideas. But lately I've just been kind of contemplating less and just doing more and simply just pressing record, thinking of what I want to kind of go as I go with it and not over, you know, thinking the moment of if I should do it. But yeah, so far the first day of Amsterdam has been nice. We got to go just around the city, explore a little bit, do a little bit of shopping and everything, have some food. And now we're just gonna kind of relax before having to create some stuff tomorrow. But that way we can just be nice and recharge before going out to the city again to get some more photos and everything that I wanna do for the next few days. So if you resonate with this video, make sure to leave a you know like and comment below. Tell me how you overcome your, I guess, creator's block or what do you do to be able to motivate yourself to create it's always interesting to see what other people do but with all that said and done guys thank you so much for watching this video make sure to like and subscribe share this video with the friend i'll catch you guys in the next one see ya